You guys want to learn a cool magic trick? I'll show you, but first, you have to realize the real secret of magic is making the illogical seem logical. Let me show you what I mean using a simple cup of water. Rich, let me ask you, would you say uh, you're a logical person? Yeah, I would think so. I'm about to question your sense of logic with a magic trick. OK. All right, check it out. I have uh, two paper bags here. I want you to make sure they're empty. This is important. Go ahead, take them, examine them. Make sure they're really empty. Yes? They're really uh, empty. about this guy? That's good. All right, check it out. I have uh, a bottle of water right here and a cup. I'll fill it with water. That should be about enough. All right, now would you say, logically speaking, it would be possible for me to move that cup of water to this other bag? No. Not possible? Absolutely not. No way? No way. All right, ready? <sighs> Blam. <laughs> what do you think about that? That was amazing. You didn't think about all the facts there. All right, all right. So obviously I touched it. The part I left out. Without touching it Without is what touching I the bag, without right, touching right, the right. cup, right? Or right. the bag. So I'll do it again. I'll make it go back, but I'm not going to touch it this time. Okay. All right? Watch. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. It really did go. Do you believe me? Or do you want proof? <laughs> I want proof. You want proof like it's actually gone? And the cup is actually ripped here. Check it out. Right. That's crazy. Whoa. Has Eric just defied logic and discovered how to teleport objects with his mind? Take a closer look as Eric performs his magic trick for another volunteer. Uh, okay. Hold on. So far, she isn't buying it. Done. We'll speed this up a little bit. Here's the transfer. Did you catch it? Now, did that look like I touched anything? No. Look, because the bag really is no. empty. And check it out. The cup is actually right back where it started. No way. Oh way. What? It's crazy. Would you say that's a logical thing that just happened there? Not at all. Has your logical mind already gotten to the bottom of this trick? How did you do that? To find out the secret. Your mind has been. Stick around. Every day, you use your problem-solving skills to get things done, from dressing for the weather, choosing the best route to work, or deciding what to eat for dinner. Regardless of the choices you make, you spend a good chunk of your life figuring out if something makes sense no. or not. Your brain uses a very specific reasoning process to make sense of the world. It's called logic. Now, whether you realize it or not, logic underlies more of your world than you might think. Just how logical are you? Here's a quick logic puzzle for you. What could you put in this wooden box that will actually make the box lighter? And the more of them you put in the box, the lighter it becomes. Got your answer? The answer is holes. The more holes you put in the box, the lighter it becomes. I know, some of you are shaking your heads right now, but here's the amazing thing. Just by trying to solve this puzzle, you've actually strengthened your brain. As it turns out, we're all born with the ability to think logically. But studies have found logic is something you can develop and hone with practice. So keep playing along as we continue to defy logic, like in our first game. It looks like magician Eric LeClaire has discovered the secret to teleportation. <sighs> Done. No! Or he's just messing with your brain. No way! And everyone was fooled. Is the cup in the bag? What? Seriously, look. Holy crap! That is oh my very God. cool. <laughs> As you can see, Eric has made the cup jump from one bag to the other without touching it. But how is that possible? It turns out he's accomplishing this very illogical feat in a very logical way. This is where the secret lies. You actually have another cup inside with the hole cut out. Aha! There 